Yo, what's up, my dudes? Thank you so much for stopping by and listen. There is so much to choose from on YouTube. I really appreciate you stopping by and checking out my content. When you get done watching this video, check out my other stuff, my other content. If you dig it, like, subscribe. Who knows? We may become best friends. I don't know about that, but you may dig some of my videos. Anyway, thank you on the video. And the first story we're going to talk about is the Mad Balls action figures, which I am so stoked about. Um, if you're not familiar, Mad Balls was a super popular 80s toy that was super popular um, in the 80s with kids, and they were kind of these gross out novelty foam balls that had monsters with like blood and ooze and kind of gory stuff. Uh, dripping out of them. Back in the 80s, shit was a little bit more edgy. I don't know if you guys remember that, but everything's kind of mellowed out now. But back in the 80s, stuff geared towards kids had a, had a little bit more gnarly edge to it, and I really like that. Um, so if you haven't heard of Mad Balls, look them up, because they're pretty awesome. The one, the original ones that came out in the 80s and early 90s um, are pretty hard to find on eBay, but they actually reissued them a few years ago. I picked up these at Best Buy. Um, uh, I think that was like, God, it had to have been 2015, 2016, um, as a Best Buy exclusive, I think, and they came out with a Freddy, Alien, they had, uh, the Leatherface here, um, Alien, and Predator, these things were just so freaking cool, and I, I picked up, I got a bunch of these, um, when they were on clearance, but, uh, now, uh, Megalopolis has, uh, announced they are releasing these exclusive, and this is Wave 1 of Mad Balls action figures, um, which is so cool. The 80s phenomenon Mad Balls is back and better than ever. They're bringing, Megalopolis Toys is bringing back the classic Mad Balls with brand new wave of figures. So we got four characters coming in the force, in the, four characters are coming back in the first wave. Uh, with Hornhead, Oculus Orbis, Bruce Brother, and Splitting Headache. Uh, Splitting Headache will be the highlight of the wave as it's the first time he will be getting his very own action figure. Now these things are so cool. They're a little pricey for the full, full set. They're running $139 for the full set. But these things are so cool looking. I guess they have interchangeable parts, fully posable kind of arms and legs. These things look so cool and I kind of want to break the bank and just buy the whole set. These things are so badass. Um, they're $35 each or you can get the whole set for I think it was $129 or $139. Um, they brought back the original designer of the original 80s Mad Balls to come back and redesign these figures and they are so cool. Um, I am def If I don't get the whole set, I'm definitely going to snag uh, a couple of them because they are just so cool they'd be so badass to have on the shelf because like i said i got a bunch of these and they are really cool to uh to display so um that is super cool they actually went up for pre-order um august 1st um and i actually just found out about these a couple days ago i didn't even know they were they were out so definitely if you were into mad balls in the 80s and that that's something that interests you you'll definitely want to look into getting these mad balls premium figures uh from Megalopolis. Uh, it's an exclusive to them. You can put in your pre-order now and get those shipped. Um, I think they said they won't be shipping until um, uh, early 2021, but I imagine these will sell out. The other ones did, uh, so definitely look at this um, as they are pretty cool. Think about subscribing. I have so much cool stuff coming up. As I said in another video, I'm doing 31 days of Halloween. So in October, I will be posting a video every single day in October, whether it's a movie review, um, physical media update, it's gonna be it's gonna be crazy. So I'm really excited for the 31 days of Halloween. I'll be including a lot of different kind of things. Uh, some kind of content, uh, horror related content will be dropping every day in October. And Pete might be in a couple of the videos. So, all right guys, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, all that classic stuff. Thank you so much. Until next time, bye. I love movies. Gosh, I love movies. I love watching them and I love making them. Nah, I can't do it.